Hello, good morning. It's Erin. Um, I know this is kind of like a weird late check-in, but it is June 10th, I think. And I did want to check in um, with everyone. I was showing a friend of mine some of the videos that I did. I hit a uh, 1,000 views on YouTube on one of my um, videos about Kratom and coming off of methadone. And I've had a lot of people hit me up on Facebook and through YouTube. And I do have to get back to a bunch of people. I'm sorry if it's shaky because I am still going through a lot of anxiety. Um, however, things are good. I know my hair is crazy. I just woke up. And um, I'm living with mom again. And she is holding so many resentments. And it's okay. Um, we fight and we argue. And I'm going to try really hard not to do so today. So I had to leave the house and I had to take a walk. Um, it's not going to be easy for her to trust me again. Uh, it's not going to be easy for me to trust myself, but I'm working steps that I need to take to be a normal human being and not be on drugs and not take methadone and uh, stay healthy. So I, um, I do know that I have really bad PTSD and generalized anxiety disorder. I went through three detoxes and a lot of extreme counseling during this period of time. I went to Tennessee for a month um, and lived in a sober living facility. And now I'm back. Um, so it's time for me to shit or get off the pot, if you will. I need to get a job. I need to get a car again. I lost everything. It was pretty bad. I don't know that this channel saw how bad I got. Um, I think I stopped recording at that point because I lost my phone. But I have a phone now, so I can do a little bit of recording. Um, so this is just going to be a quick five-minute thing. Um, so Kratom definitely helped. Uh, I did 45 days of detoxing off of methadone, which was hell. Um, I also had stopped taking my anxiety medication, which I now know that I need because without it, I am fatigued. I am stressed. I am overeating. I am, um, like outbursting with outbursts on everyone, not even just my mom, just in general. Um, and I know that's my anxiety because in general, when I'm sober and clean, I am not that much of a bitch. So, I need to um, probably go see my psychiatrist and figure out what kind of medication is going to work best for me. I did go to the ER yesterday for an unrelated disease issue. It's not a disease. It was an issue. Um, and he noticed my trembling and my shaking and asked me about anxiety and gave me um, a couple Klonopin. And I feel 100% better. So if anybody has anything that they can suggest for anxiety, because I do have generalized anxiety and PTSD really, really bad. Like really bad. If somebody claps their hands, I jump. Um, it doesn't help that I got beat up by a drug dealer um, back in April. And my face was really, really messed up. I broke my eye socket and cheekbone and jaw. And luckily it didn't screw my face up too bad, but I definitely need some suggestions on some anxiety medication that's gonna help. I've been on Klonopin for years and years and years and years and years, and I was just off of it for over 30 days. So I kinda need help. I am gonna go see my psychiatrist probably next week. Um, and yeah help with any sort of ideas on anxiety. Now I could take Kratom. I know that that helped. Um, it definitely helped with my withdrawals big time. So if somebody has a suggestion on what kind of Kratom to take um, for anxiety, like debilitating anxiety, I can't even get out of bed. It's like agoraphobia. It's bad. Um, anyway, I got to peace out because my thing's going to stop. Love you guys.